Hello, Brandon Valley. My name is George Wright, and I'm running to be your next student body president. I, along with my vice president, Kyle Spanton, represent the, the Federalist Party. Our party wishes to make necessary changes to benefit our student body and faculty as a whole. We believe that music is essential to students' well-being and happiness. Therefore, music would be allowed to be listened to during study halls and work time. We would also like to enhance the learning of our students by adding lifeguard training courses and more foreign language courses, such as French and Norwegian. Along with education, the improvement of student life is one of our top priorities. Slides would be installed on all staircases, making the journey from one class to another more enjoyable, while also providing a safe and efficient way downstairs. Improving on our current celebrations, we would allow the underclassmen the opportunity to attend prom if asked by an upperclassman. We would also add an end of the year celebration including a petting zoo, a fair, free food, and a concert. The school lunch policy would also be modified, allowing open lunch for everyone with their free choice of transportation. Lunch periods would also be lengthened to a full 50 minutes with the elimination of team classes. Along with these changes, our party would also like to construct an aquatic center, complete with swimming pools and diving boards, to better enhance the learning of our students while offering them another place to recreate. Construction of this facility and all other construction, however, would not be done during the school year, as this is a horrific disruption of the learning environment along with our students' and staff's well-being. To offer a students a change of scenery and school activities, our party would like to add a dodgeball team and a hockey team, with the exception of cutting golf and tennis. To help pay for all these things, we propose the opening of the Aquatic Center to the public for business, along with a recycling center. Not only would the recycling center help generate revenue for the school, but it would aid in keeping BBHS clean as well. Our, one national issue we are facing today is that the national minimum, minimum wage is not increasing proportionally to the inflation that our economy is experiencing. We would raise national minimum wage to $9 an hour in looking to help make the cost of living more affordable. To cover our national debt, our party would implement the pay-go system, which is, for, which is for every program or spending bill we add, an equal or greater cut would need to be made somewhere else. This system, along with a minor tax increase and decreased military spending, would hunt down our national debt in no time. Speaking of hunting, my opponent AK wants to add a falconry class, which is the training of dangerous birds to attack other animals. To me, this sounds like an accident waiting to happen, with birds being unpredictable and trained to kill. Calvin wants to promote hostility and violence among students by introducing a mixed martial arts class. This is not only a huge liability for the school, but would, but would promote physical bullying among students as well. Brandon Valley is an ever-changing environment, but, is, but this is not the change that you need. Winston Churchill once said, to improve is to change, to be perfect is to change often. So today, I politely ask you for your vote and letting my experienced team make the right changes for you. And remember, if it's not right, it's wrong.